Hello and welcome to another Talking Flu with Matt Drew. And for the first time this week, I'm going to start by talking about something that isn't directly related to flu, the COVID vaccine. It is coming. And for many of us at Team SHSC, it will be here next month. We'll confirm this, but you're going to have to leave at least a week between your flu jab and your COVID jab. So our message to you is this, get your flu jab now so that you're ready for your COVID jab. And over 63% of us have already got our flu vaccinations and the flu jab team are now gonna start working with individual teams. So you can expect extra clinics and targeted flu vaccinations. And if you haven't got your jab yet and you want to, have a look on the internet. All the information about the clinics and peer vaccinators is on there. We've also had a few risers in our league table this week. So Forest Close are up by 11%. The Recovery North team are up by 9%. And the PGME team are up by a whopping 16%. Well done to all of you. Now, today we're gonna to talk a little bit about causality, where one event, process, state or object, a cause, contributes directly to the production of another event, process, state or object and effect. And there are lots of examples of this in history. So monarchical ineptitude and the French Revolution. Merry men and tights. Having a sleep under an apple tree and getting a bump on the head out. Brian Clough and Nottingham Forest's ascent to European dominance. Twice. But what else could we add to that? Well, if you get your flu jab now, that will be the cause. The effect will be not only that you are protected from flu, but also that you're ready to get your COVID vaccine as soon as it arrives. Thank you very much for watching Talking Flu. We'll see you next week.